They'll be out, all my friends in the gospel out there. I'm going to get to the point. My message is get rid of the omen. You mean omen? What, what do you mean, Preacher Warren, omen? Well, there was a movie that came out called Omen years ago back in the 70s, I believe it was. After that demonic movie came out, Exorcist, Omen was supposed to be the son of Satan. And he was going around making bad things happen, making people kill themselves and commit suicide. Well, that's what the devil's about. He's about to steal, kill, and destroy. He's about corruption. Well, many of you are married to an omen. He may not be the son of Satan, but many of you got husbands or boyfriends or girlfriends who ain't nothing but a curse. And this is why you've been cursed, because you're married to a curse. You're sleeping with a curse. You're having sex with a curse. So those demonic spirits transfer on you. And that's why you're so stressed out and why all these bad things are happening to you. You with someone who's evil, they are omen. That's why bad things are happening. You can't put a curse with a blessing. The Bible declares can two walk together except they be agreed. Read the book of Amos chapter number three, verse number three. Many of you are in love with an omen. You're getting children by an omen. So now he don't want to pay no child support. He's a sperm donor, making all these babies around New York City and around the world, not just New York. Many of you are in love with a street thug who don't want to work. Got his drawers showing, pants half down. And many of you don't even realize that the devil has assigned these men and the devil has assigned these women in your life to break your heart. It's best to fall in love with Jesus and get rid of the omen and get with Jesus Christ. He's the one who sacrifices life on the cross of Calvary.